Well, hello everybody. This is Gene again from Tucson, Arizona, broadcasting through my fabulous YouTube carrier. YouTube's the greatest thing to do movies through. This is now my Velocity Polak, if you remember, wind checker. Today it's breezy, so I can be a little more accurate on what I'm doing here. Uh, what I did in my first YouTube, which I hope you have saw, uh, viewed, uh, I showed you how a wind barometer works. Uh, it's my own invention. I have a patent, patent pending, and I sent myself the letter, as you're supposed to do. What happens is the wind, I'll show you uh, where the wind is coming from. This is Tucson, Arizona, and here is a, a wagon wheel wind that uh, is showing you there is a wind coming up. Now, what I did is I made a tape, a tape that swings with the wind, uh, the velocity of the wind. Now I'm checking through the uh, wind indicators on channel 22 on TV Arizona. Uh, when the wind is 15 miles an hour, that tape will change and will go 15 miles an hour and it'll mark on the chart. I'll bring it up close now and show you what I'm doing with the chart. Okay, now it is my Polak wind velocity gauge. I have the wind, the tape set, if it goes up to 45, that means the wind is 45 miles, okay, the velocity of the wind is 45 miles per hour. Then I have it one set at a lower uh, setting at 30, and then another one at 15. Now if the wind goes in the other direction, uh, that is also set. Uh, at 15, 30, and 45. Now, in any minute now, uh, the wind will start blowing again. There it goes. And you see, see how the the uh, tape uh, blows. Now, it's very accurate. I have to uh, synchronize the uh, wind speeds, as I said, through the weather reports. I haven't done that yet. But I think this is a great idea, and I think it's something you can see and view from your living room. Or sitting out on the porch and having a beer and looking at that. Say, gee, I better not go shopping today. Look at that wind. Look at that wind. It's going all the way up to 45. It's a gusty wind today, and tomorrow will really be windy. Tomorrow will be so windy I won't be able to demonstrate this. But uh, you can see now that the wind is coming from my left or your right, and uh, it's really bringing up some wind. Now, yesterday we didn't have any wind. Um, it's now uh, close over 90 degrees. It won't be uh, any lower than 60 degrees tonight. Uh, you can see where the wind is coming from, uh, and you can see what's happening to my tape. Now, as I said in my first YouTube, the tape, I'm going to do this quick so I can get it done quick. The bottom of the tape will have uh, various things, like horses or eagles or things, and depending on what it is will um, make the price go up or down. Now, this whole set is $5. Five dollars a set. Now, if the ornament is more expensive, it'll go up a little bit. Uh, I am interested in a manufacturer that will partnership up with me and uh, manufacture this idea. Uh, I do have a patent pending, so uh, it can't be copied at this moment. I did what they asked. The instructions is to mail yourself the copy of your patent pending. Now you can see there's no win, uh, but that's only for a moment. Now it's starting up again. Um, it's a good way to demonstrate it when it's windy because it tells you how, how the uh, tape swings. And uh, this was an accident. I was sitting out in the living room and I saw the tape I had left for something and I saw, noticed how it reacts to the weather. And now if the wind, as I said before, comes from the other direction, the tape will go the other way. And wherever that tape rests or stays, that's your wind velocity. It's kind of funny. It's different. And uh, I don't think anybody has it. Uh, there it is. See, it's going up to about 30 miles per hour wind, but it's gusty winds. And pretty soon our plants out here in Tucson, Arizona ain't going to be worth a darn because when that heat hits them, they'll bake. All my pansies and tulips and all that, I have to pull inside and keep them out of the sun because that sun will bake. And that's right around the corner. Within a month or so, we're going to have some real hot weather here. Uh, it's going to last for a long time, 90, 95, 100 degree weather. And that's when I have to start turning on my air conditioner. Uh, right now, I'll go to the temperature, which is right next to my wind barometer, and it shows here it's uh, 95 out uh, right now, and uh, it's approaching 100. It'll probably do 100 today. 
uh, as I can, from my experience, I've been living here 40 years, so I know I know Tucson, Arizona. In Arizona, uh, just like Andrew, I said, we do everything right in Arizona, and Michelle Bachman. We do everything right here. And uh, I'm an independent. I don't want to get involved in politics. I just want you to see my new uh, Polak wind velocity indicator. I added the word velocity. In my first YouTube, that word is not in there. But um, when I synchronize, as I said earlier in this YouTube, it would be more accurate. Now I'm going to sign off now because I want it to, to go through and I don't want to take all day for, for uh, YouTube to process it. You guys have a nice day and this is Gene Freeman broadcasting from Tucson, Arizona. It's April 1st and it's 2011 and in 2012 our Arizona, my beautiful lovely Arizona will be 100 years old. That's right, we'll be a century old next year. Send us a piece of cake and a beer, okay? Have a nice day and uh, I hope you understand this. Uh, I would appreciate comments on this and see if I'm crazy or not with my Pollock wind velocity indicator. You know when you're retired and you got nothing to do, you do silly things. But I think this is a good idea. It's something that's inexpensive. It's a lot of fun to watch. Okay? You have a nice day. Have a good day. Bye. This is Gene from Tucson, Arizona.